Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In today's video, we are having one very interesting question from rational equations. We have to solve x square minus 3x plus 1 over 2x whole square plus x square plus 5x plus 1 over 2x whole square is equal to 3 square. And we have to find out real solutions only. So let's get started by writing our denominator cannot be 0. So x cannot be 0. Now I will multiply our equation by 4. Both sides. This side also with 4. Now we can cancel this 4 and denominator 2. 4 and denominator 2. So our equation will become x square minus 3x plus 1 over x whole square plus x square plus 5x plus 1 over x whole square and right hand side is 9 times 4 so 36 as x cannot be equal to 0 so I can divide so let me divide our numerator by x x minus 3 plus 1 over x whole square here I will be writing x plus 5 plus 1 over x whole square and right hand side is 36. After rearranging the terms x plus 1 over x minus 3 whole square plus x plus 1 over x plus 5 whole square equal to 36. Now I will use our substitution. Let us consider x plus 1 over x plus 1 equal to a. So first bracket, this bracket will give us a minus 4 and this bracket will give us a plus 4. So I can write our equation as a minus 4 whole square plus a plus 4 whole square equal to 36. Now I will use two algebraic identities a plus b whole square a minus b whole square formula. So let me write here a minus 4 whole square plus a plus 4 whole square equal to 36. Now I will write a square minus 8a plus 16 and here I will be writing a square plus 8a plus 16 and right hand side is 36. Now minus 8a and plus 8a will be over. So 2 times a square plus 16 will be our LHS and RHS is 36. Equation is divisible by 2. Let's divide. a square plus 16 equal to 18. Take away 16 from both sides. a square will be equal to 18 minus 16. So it will be 2. Now considering a square root both sides, I can write a will be equal to plus and minus a square root. Now a was our substitution x plus 1 over x plus 1 equal to plus minus root 2. Now we will frame two equations one with plus sign another with minus sign. Let me write x plus 1 over x plus 1 equal to plus root 2. And second equation will be x plus 1 over x plus 1 equal to minus a square root. So let us solve this first equation first. So I will write x plus 1 over x equal to root 2 minus 1. Multiply this equation by x both sides as x is non-zero. So x square plus 1 equal to root 2 minus 1 times x. 
take all the term to one side x square minus root 2 minus 1 times x plus 1 equal to 0. Now I will use quadratic formula. So x will be equal to minus b so root 2 minus 1 plus minus the square root of b square. So it will be root 2 minus 1 whole square minus 4ac so minus 4 only divided by 2a so 2. In next step we can write root 2 minus 1 plus minus the square root of 2 plus 1 minus 2 root 2. This is expansion of root 2 minus 1 whole square and then minus 4 divided by 2. Now you can see root 2 minus 1 plus minus square root of 3 minus 4 is minus 1 and minus 2 root divided by 2. Now we know that the square root of minus 1 is complex number i. So i will write minus outside as i. So this will become x is equal to root 2 minus 1 plus minus i and in bracket I will write in a square root bracket 1 plus 2 root 2 divided by so from here we are getting complex solutions, complex solutions, so these solutions are rejected. Now I will consider our second equation, this was x plus 1 over x equal to minus of root 2 plus 1 in the bracket. Now I will multiply again both sides by x as x is non-zero. So x square plus 1 equal to minus of root 2 plus 1 times x. Take all the term to LHS. x square plus root 2 plus 1 times x plus 1 equal to 0. This is one quadratic equation. Let's apply quadratic formula first. Let me write here x square plus root 2 plus 1 times x plus 1 equal to 0. So x will be equal to minus b. So minus of root 2 plus 1 plus minus the square root of b square. So root 2 plus 1 whole square minus 4ac, so minus 4 only, divided by 2a, a is 1, so 2, minus of root 2 plus 1 plus minus, let us expand, a plus b whole square, root 2 square is 2, 1 a square is 1, 2ab will give us 2 root 2 and then we have minus 4 divided by 2. Further I can write minus of root 2 plus 1 plus minus sine and then we have 3 minus 4. So I will write 2 root 2 with plus sign and then minus 1 divided by 2. So here we are having two real solutions which we are going to accept. Let me write both the solutions here. So x will be equal to minus of root 2 plus 1 plus the square root of 2 root 2 minus 1 divided by 2 first real solution. And second real solution let me write x1 x2 equal to root 2 plus 1 minus the square root of 2 root 2 minus 1 divided by 2. So these are our ultimate real solutions for the given 
rational equation challenge i hope friends you will like this video thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care of yourself bye bye